Why would the United States consider Crimea an annexed territory and do not, do not, is not Boca to consider Cameroon present in Ambazonia an annexation? <coughs> do, do you want the diplomatic answer or the real answer? I want the real answer. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the, the, the real answer is that train left the station in 1961 or, or, or whenever. No one is going to go back to that. Uh, the Crimea, is, Crimea situation happened, you know, in the last few years. So, you know, that is very much on the agenda of the world right now. Um, you know, again, the Amazonia situation in some respects is like Somaliland, because Somaliland, as you said in your intro, uh, you know, the, uh, it was an independent state before uh, southern Somalia became an independent state. But, but the big difference is Somaliland actually uh, exercises governmental, full governmental control over its territory. It's a lot easier to make your case when you are running a de facto state, whereas in Ambazonia, uh, you know, like it or not, it's the government of Cameroon which exercises sovereignty, more or less. I mean, we all know the, the struggle that's going on on the ground. So, you know, unfortunately, uh, those legal arguments can come into play later. Again, when you have a unified stand, when you're engaging with the international community from a unified point of view. But right now, uh, you know, you're basically, as I would say, shooting blanks out of a gun because, uh, you know, the, the international community just not going to, to take any action based on those arguments, no matter how justified. You can have a lot of academicians you know, who respect those, they will write wonderful academic papers, maybe even doctoral dissertations, uh, but they will end up on the shelf. Are we going to see somebody like Thibaut Natch, who have eaten African food, walk our land, take on that role as a lobby for humanity's sake, for humanity's and sake. Dance, and danced African dances, but don't forget that. <laughs> <laughs> you know, <laughs> yeah, he, 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 he also previously made a lot of comments uh, citing the creation and the multiplication of the so-called interim government as the key factor in projecting a negative perception of the Ambazonian struggle to the international community.